Welcome back to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming, where we are the voices inside your head. I'm Jonas. I'm TNT Dynamite, the explosive one. We're playing the complex. Yeah, dude. We're It's a complex. It's a complex. We just man. found out Nobody that Bleeding Eye this. Lady has all the master particles in her nanotech in her body. Yeah, she ate a whole bunch of nano cells, and she's going to die from it, probably. Yeah, we don't know for sure, but yeah, she seems not happy. None of our party members like us. The dead guy likes us better than everyone else. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> it's nuts. I like how there's, wait, there's nine characters and we see 22% of them in the first eight seconds yeah, of the game. Hey, that's hey, it. Let's keep, let's, we, we, we got got to meet your party members. I need to know who I want to take on raids. Uh, right? All right. We got a meeting with the big boss to find out more about the nanotech. You think mm -hmm. she's going to be cute? Uh, we Ooh. already saw her. Oh my God, you guys are serious about your fashion. No more frumpy hazmat suits. Precious you suits. took your mask off anyways. You'll see. All right. Wait, what? Co-ed locker rooms? Change, change in the cubicle, dude. We ain't changing with Reese, dude. Yes. Uh, thank you, sir. I'll be like, going she in doesn't here. even like him. Why would she change in the same room with him? I know, right? Hey, oh, look at this. What am I looking at? Does this feel personal? Claire? Of course. Well, she was in excruciating pain and she stumbled all the way to the tube station. Feels more emotional than just following orders. That main character's pretty cute, though. She's plain Jane, but... She's no. smart. Like I said, man, this, this is this game is pretty well shot. It's pretty well. Uh, We're going into space. Like the characters are well acted. Yeah. I wonder why the, these sort of games haven't caught on in the states. Active. Mm -hmm. Something like that. Like I mean, they had that one oh, game no. on Netflix or the one on Stack Netflix. Max is the last line of defense. Bonder Dash or whatever, whatever it was. The lack of air makes it sterile as hell. Well, that's great on a microscopic level, but it could do with some physical... ...barriers. How long have you worked here again? Uh, we'll I'll, engage him, I'll dude. engage him. <coughs> I'm not gonna be Four a jerk to him. Wednesday. Yeah. It's been that long. Just thinking about some of the stuff we saw. I saw a whole other year's worth after you left. It wasn't just skydiving. I needed a reset. Try new things. Like Learn anything up on that can help us today? Hope not. What the hell is yeah, going on? What the hell on? is happening? Why are they in like a empty space? Dude, this is scary. <laughs> right? <laughs> I would be terrified. There's like no sound. Yeah, it's like that's... an anti echo chamber. Oh, that's weird. Yeah, it is pretty weird. So the meditation's new. So is the spying. Touche. Vacuum conditions inactive. Do, 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 oh, he was do, do, meditating in there. That's what he was doing. Microscopes, petri dishes. Oh, she's in a. Tube. Metal carts. Is that an iron lung? Lab coats. Do they even use iron lungs anymore? Uh, I did. I, honestly, I just read an article on it. I guess there's like one Dr. guy Thomas or two Malcolm, people who Dr. still are. I'm really Nora. This is Dr. Reese Wakefield. He'll be assisting us today. Cool pony cell. Let me take you to her. Wait, so they had to wear those suits to get through the area and then come to here and <sighs> don't have to wear them? Yeah, yeah, that's how it works. Matryoshka dolls. Yeah. Russian, aren't they? So what's your story then, Malkin? <laughs> I've wanted to assist Dr. Tennant since I saw a talk at the Plains Summit about the extracellular matrix and lattice in stem cells. I'm sorry, what? Uh, yeah, that's what I say. He just walks away. <laughs> nah, I think he gets it, though. I don't Holy get it. Holy shit. It's attacking the bone structure. We've never know. seen anything like it. Well, I have a sample of her blood under the microscope. Oh, what's it doing? It's gonna turn her into a zombie. Would it make her just like a superhuman? 
because it's like, what's it doing? It's attacking her. Guys, this is my tech. <gasps> the nano cells are inside her. She but they're unfinished. There's no off switch, so they're just coursing through her body, producing excess bone and blood. But how could she have contracted them? From a spillage, maybe. They barely survive for two minutes once they're exposed to air, and she didn't have the authorization to access them. Someone's put them in her. No, 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 no. leave it in, Claire. You need it. Oh, feels fucking weird. <laughs> yeah, you that's keeping blood and bleeding through your eye. Are you a terrorist? Be a terrible one if I was. <laughs> I did this for Nina. What's Mina? Terrorist organization. Oh, please stop that, please. Look, how many times have we seen a lone wolf release pathogens into the air? Nanocells aren't airborne. They can only be transferred via blood to blood contact. Yeah, somebody injected her, see? Answer call. <clears throat> Bioterrorism suspect named as Claire Mahek, a Tube terrorist. TV off. Wow, and they're just trying to make her out to be a terrorist. Tell me you can just achieve like us, Jonas, even in <laughs> Britain. Directly. We'd need to extract a large blood sample to keep them active. From there, I'll use that as a roadmap to recreate the master batch. Seems simple enough. She's yes, plenty that's of simple. blood to spare. Not exactly. Her new bone matter is consuming her body's resources at an accelerated rate. If I we'll remove that much blood in one go, she'll die. Killer, and dude. she dies before you extract her blood? Without a living host, the nanocells will just dissipate. Au revoir, nanocells. So either way, she dies. Okay. Amy, we're going to have to go for the option where we retain our asset. Natalie, I can't just... I'll get back to you. End call. Well, yeah, well like, if she's going to die either way... That's what I'm saying. Like, what why should we do, doctor? Take the one batch, dude. And your boss just told Set you. Set up for a full blood diagnostic. There has to be a way to get the nanocells out of her safely. Yeah, we can see what we can do, but... <laughs> Dr. Wakefield, please replace her IV. I can't risk any outside contamination. Sure thing. Please. Dr. Tennant. Please replace her IV. <laughs> Put him on IV duty. Oh, no. Is he going to get it? Oh, no. Blood to blood, dude. Don't get any gonna... blood in your blood. Need to replace this, okay? Don't bite me. This dude's a dick. Don't bite me. He's like me. one of those guys who thinks he's funny, but he really comes across Ooh. as abrasive. <laughs> Shit, sorry. Dude, oh, why would you do? Why would you do that? Dude, IV suck. <laughs> don't. Don't go anywhere. He just got her blood on his hand. He just dripped it in the. He had a glove on. Uh huh. Didn't he? Did he not have a he glove? He did. Okay. Yeah. I mean, that's still stupid. Yeah, he's like blood to blood only. He's and he's just, and he's just carrying the needle the above his straight. gloved hand, his latex oh, gloved hand. <laughs> Yo. Well, it's in the way. It needs to be moved. Uh. Amy, we'll do it ourselves. Uh, Amy? Yeah, I'll just do it. It's probably too heavy. Don't worry about that. That's what we're here for. Thank you, Dr. North. Oh, she's like, I how I wouldn't want you to watch her drop it. Yo, do doctors really son doctors like that? <gasps> what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Dr. North? <laughs> what? What is that? What? It's not personal. <laughs> Yo, what the fuck? <laughs> Yo, what the What is happening? No! He just It is not. Wow, Whoa. I guess. Uh, Do something, Amy. Use a lamp. Hit him with something. He bites him. Oh. He's going to get him in him because he has blood on his glove and the glove's going to go in the. Where is he? I'm good. I'm good. Check on Dr. North. Uh, check, yeah, check on Dr. North. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, the uh, see the blood, the the nanotech. Yeah, dude. Doctor North, Doctor North, trust me, talk to me. Oh, 
We're gonna save you, okay? What did you get? Is that the nanotech viruses? I don't know, dude. What the hell is happening? <laughs> Take the glove off. I knew there was something off about Malkin. What kind of a scientist has a fucking ponytail? <laughs> Don't you have to like restrain that dude? He's he's gonna be fine. Unless No, he's getting the nanotech into his blood to blood, dude. I'm the safest person in this room. Good enough for me. Why are we in lockdown mode? It's detecting the poison from the acid bomb. It won't be in the air for much longer. Thanks for that. How's this bee so cog cognizant right now? I don't know. Yeah, she's doing pretty Emily, good for dying. where's Natalie? There's been an incident in the lab. Yeah, I can see that, and the biosecurity's kicked in. I need Natalie on the line right now. I don't care who she's with. Yeah, okay, she's in her office. I'll call you right back. All right, yeah. Cool. When are they going to realize that he got the nanotech in him? First things first, let's get this cleaned up. Okay, she's like... Mm-hmm. Oh. We'll be back in a minute, Claire. Don't go anywhere. Acid bomb, <laughs> dude. It was just acid. It was not nanotechs. What the fuck? No mistake yet. Well, that needs to come out one way or another. Kensington could have at least left. You leave the knife in, though. Whiskey. I guess she's a doctor. She knows what she's mm -hmm. doing. Ah. Uh, Slap him. Oh, this is gonna stink. <laughs> ah! The fuck? Ah! <laughs> what the fuck? That was good. It was. I have to clean this wound. No, 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 it'll be fine. We've got bigger fish to fry. He's also a doctor. Yeah, yeah. I know. <laughs> Did you hear that? Yeah, what was that? Uh, search Best for... Best to get noise, dude. I think we should. It came from the void. Here. Tie oh, this I don't up. like the fact they call it the it void, the either. Way. Yeah, right? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Welcome to the club, buddy. <laughs> can she see through? Oh, she can see into the void. Oh, screw this, dude. Screw this. Yeah, dude. Screw this, buddy. This game's going to get scary, dude. Dude, I don't like scary games. What the hell is that? It's more. It must be coming from beyond the walls. Is there any security cameras we can check? On the computer, but What did they do with the guy with the ponytail? With right, would you mind? I, they just knocked them out, dude. Once you get knocked out in the movie, you're knocked out for like ever. That's the end. Oh, look at this guy. He just knows the system. Yeah. Right, got it. He's a doctor. He's the security cameras in the void. Alright, what's there? Ooh. <laughs> Shit on the eye. Just a couple guys? Yeah. The cavalry? <laughs> in masks? What's All of a sudden, it's though? the purge? Sound doesn't travel in a vacuum. Oh, that's why it was quiet. They just took Shit, off. They've deactivated the vacuum. No prizes for guessing who the brains of this operation is. Oh, it's not security walls, eh? Oh no. This is impossible. Oh, they would no. need unprecedented access to our security systems to be doing this. Oh, it's getting real, oh, Jonas. Oh, God, dude. <laughs> On the next episode, Whoa, we'll have to fend off dude. the attackers. Yeah, they're wearing our suits from the Congo, dude. <laughs> right? <laughs> I know, dude. Old war all buddies. Right, that's all the time we have for today's episode, Crazy Towns, folks. Please make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoy our content. If you've done that, hit the notification bell. We'll, it'll tell you when we do stuff. Uh, but for Jonas, I'll uh, we'll catch you on the next one. We are out.